Hello and welcome back to Battletech. I'm Shadowcoast and welcome to the channel. We are continuing our Battletech extended playthrough and we are taking on more clan content. So we're going to focus on a few of these missions that have 2 out of 8 salvage, 2 out of 9 salvage. We're going to start small and work our way up in the hopes of gaining some awesome, awesome stuff. We have our first Storm Crow clan mech but we don't have any weapons on it yet and that's because we want to put some clan weapons on it to really make it what we want it so for this deployment we're going with our quote-unquote B team well actually we'll go with our our predominantly A team then given the looks of it we're gonna let Tengu sit here he's reducing our upkeep I don't think I'm ready to deploy with him yet, uh, but we, we will soon. So let's um, jump in. All right. We are having fun. So quick comment. We're sitting in mid of August. It's August 20th as of this recording. Now the way uh, the videos work is I will record them when I have time, which tends to be on the weekend, and then I will schedule them in the future. So the recording date is August 20th, but the posting date will potentially be in September. You guys can see, you know, actually I don't know if you can see uh, the date a video becomes available. All that is to say that as of August, as of today, Battletech Extended, um, at least as of this morning when I checked, is still not on Nexus Mod. So what's happening is is that you cannot access Battletech Extended uh, because Harry, the, the modder, I think that's how you say his name, uh, removed it from Nexus Mod. I do not have a safe link to download Battletech yet. So if and when I find one that is safe and reliable, not just someone giving you files or transmitting them because you never know what's in there, I will post an updated video and let you know. Unfortunately, I don't have that right now. So the, the modder, uh, you know, he, he's, I believe it's a he uh, mentioned that he was assessing where to put the mod and how to make it accessible. If you go to the Discord channel, um, which I, I don't have, I, I don't want to share it because I don't want to provide misinformation. Um, if you do find the appropriate dis Discord channel, there are individuals on there who will provide you files. I can't vouch for them. I don't know who, you know, if it's safe. Uh, so once once the files are housed somewhere safe, or if they go back on Nexus Mod, I'll post a video. So just want to address that because there were some comments and questions, uh, and unfortunately I don't have answers yet. All right. First step, find your target and the location and extract safely. Keep the mech carrying the VIP in one piece. Best of luck, Commander. All right. the we so, done, the sooner we can vacate this freaking jungle. Interesting setup. Uh, I, I don't disagree with you. I copy. Nope. Oh. It'd take a long time. We're going to travel through... Wooded territory, which will slow us down. Moving out. So if I can pick open open spots, that will reduce our. Uh, travel distance reduction. Phoenix Hawk. I guess we have a, a lot further to go. I am assuming, yeah, we can. Interesting map. I've fought several battles on this map. Never a rescue, though. Always a battle. So that is good to know. 
I actually kind of think this is an interesting recovery type map. Affirmative. Nothing yet. Alright, so the way we're going to do this is, strategically speaking, to maximize our travel distance. We're going to stay in this white area. Well, this is our scout, so the scout's kind of different. Scout is like, we just want to move far enough to like identify the enemy, and that's it. But for these, our core mechs here, what we're going to do is we're going to kind of group them up here in this open spot, and we're just going to stay uh, on the tree line until we get up here, and then we're going to enter the tree line as we get closer, because we should probably encounter the enemy at that point. So now that we're getting closer, yep, there we go. Contact. So we're going to reserve everything down. And we will. Looks like they're well within range. Got a Fenris. Ooh, got a direct Copy line that. of sight. Waiting for order. Oop. On it. What can I do for you? We have our clan goss, so we're gonna All are go. miss with the goss. We did hit the head. Engaging jump jets. Uh, we missed. He can see us yet. Solid hit, but he's reducing damage taken. That's okay. Alright, there is a... Okay, I'd rather advance you up. Got some vehicles down there. Next gathering. One hit. Yes, Commander. Not Move moving as speed. fast, but that's okay. On it. For extreme range, low profile on his end. Obstructed. Solid connection announced. Yes, Commander. Firing on target. I had a miss, double miss. Good to go. Uh -huh. I kind of keep our marauder back. would be stressed too. Alright, let's um engaging jump jets. Jump up and engaging target. Alright, we're exposed here, so we will move first. They flow 
going past my armor. Commander. Sensors locked on. Oh, they can still see us. Please, well, we'll see. Right leg destroyed. He panicked and bugged out. Whoa, no! No! Misclick of epic proportions. Ow, what double hit with four evasion. Waiting for orders. We're gonna go ahead and call Malarkey. Don't need to tell me twice. Take this. Wondering if that AC5 is better because we get the Ooh. Ow, searchlight destroyed. Kill, but enemy unit destroyed. Standing by. Acknowledged. Good to go. Putting you out front. All right. Yes, Commander. Copy that. All right, we're still in cover. Lots of evasion. Look at that Black Hawk. Look at that. Like a, like a, a souped up Storm Crow. All that's to say, um... Going for a vision tank a little bit here. Critical 
Yeah, we should probably aim shot. Ow. Hey, who's an armor over here? Ow. Oh boy, I'm a little nervous about Square. I'm a lot nervous. Eats it. Good to go. Firing. Oh, wow. They blow past my armor. We're receiving you. Uh, worth the, the shot at that puma. Alright. Warning. Armor low. I'm gonna take that black hawk out. On you, Commander. Really do, but All right, let's see what happens. Yeah, we should have. We overheat? No, we did not. Great. At the Euler or Puma, that's a Puma, I think. Yeah, it's a pretty good mech. Given its like size, speed, and armament, I mean, it's a light mech. So where the bomb lands matters. So this was in front of you. Orders. Great, great. So Can keep working on taking mix off the off the board. Waiting for orders. Targeting Think I hit something good.
Taking some solid hits. Damage minimal. Ready for order. But for the most part, I think firing jump. Can be okay. All right, let's um waiting for orders. We're just going to wait here and stay safe actually. Okay. We're still Come pretty on. far back. We got this. There you go. Like I said mech or clan clan mech killer. To clean up some of these mechs and then we'll focus on that puma. Are you coming in for? Yeah, you're coming in for. Uh, What's up, boss? A um, Oh, this is the clan ERPPC Blackhawk. Okay. With all their profiles and Oh, we only did one evasion? Ah, oh, son of a gun. Target eliminated. Should. Receiving. I should have jumped in retrospect. Oh well. You're on our target list. Warning. Armor low. Waiting for orders. Locked on to your armor. Waiting on you, Commander. Coordinates received. I'd rather take the vehicle out and not risk it. Just take less damage. Location confirmed. All weapons are go. Got a critical hit. I'm under heavy fire. Receiving. What did I say? Puma would be next. All weapons committed. Order. Target. That hit something good. All 
All right. Um. Got it. Standing by. All right. All right, hold position. We have the asset, Commander. Okay, that one felt good. Felt like we could, we had it under control the majority of the time. We did take some damage, but that's to obviously be expected. Um, so we're at least coming off a mission where we feel good. So then when we're r ratcheting up the difficulty dramatically, we, you know, we have reason to believe we can. So that costs a million to deploy. Net, net it costs a million, okay. So, thirty five standard range, long range. We're going to risk it. Ah, uh, we should not have risked it. We should not have risked it. We should have just got the two ER lead. Okay. Yeah, that corrupts large laser. Useless. Should have. That's okay. What should I go? We want to get some of those plan ER medium lasers. We can stick them on our storm crow, and then we'll be a semi sniping storm crow. What I really wanted was an extended range, large pulse laser, two of those, and then some of the medium pulse lasers. So we just like our pulse laser wubsy mech. But um, I don't think that makes sense. We should just, you know, it's probably easier to get clan ER medium lasers. They're a dime a dozen. Okay, so we will, we will do that. Drop down here by a million. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna call this one an episode. We're, we're keeping these episodes shorter because time is of the essence as of late, and I want to make sure. I can still post three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I'm going to attempt to keep that schedule. It might fluctuate depending, um, but that's the goal. Okay, so we're going to call this a mission, but, or episode, but in the next one, I feel like... Sorry, surveillance pictures show that a heavy clan star was inserted in the planet's service by Clan Ghost Bear dropship. Currently, we believe they're securing their LZ, preparing for operations. Um, they have planned before they finish securing the area. We'd like you to interrupt them. Alright. Um, We need you to be the backup of our Russell Hagian forces to make a start to further operations. We ex expect significant opposition. 
which is where you come in. Um, we'll see. I think we'll probably do Rolling Thunder. Um, I so if this one makes me nervous because it's paying us more, giving us better salvage. This one makes me nervous too. Then it's like, if it's a drop ship, that could be three lances of fifteen all closely. I don't know. In any, in all of these, they could be close together. They could be spread out. So it really, I guess, just doesn't matter. But like conceptually speaking, I think I'm more comfortable doing Rolling Thunder in zero hour. Um, and so we will see. I think we'll, we'll do Rolling Thunder. This will be interesting. We'll. We'll fight again next to the Free Republic, and, and they can take some of the damage at all of it. And we just have to keep one of them alive, which isn't, might not be an easy task. If they, like, go crazy and run in there, it can be actually extremely difficult to, to help them. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to see more of this playthrough, please drop a like and comment. That keeps me going. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing to support the channel. That's the best way you can currently support my channel. And it is very much appreciated. Thanks so much for watching and hope to see you in future videos. Shadow Coast out.